hey guys welcome back to my channel again if you are watching me for the very first time um, you're welcome to this channel and and I hope you can subscribe so that anytime I upload a new video you'll be the first to know and if you have uh, been my subscriber over the years and you are here today thank you so much for supporting me I really appreciate you guys and so guys make sure you like this video as you're watching it just click the like button like that this video will have more rating and more people can see it i really appreciate when you like my video so for today's video um we're making lemonade hairstyle and this is like my daughter's favorite hairstyle and because her birthday is around the corner, she wanted to do like some photo shoot. So she asked me to do this hairstyle. Right, so before this time, the hair has been washed and perfectly dried and prepped for this hairstyle. It, um, her scalp is not dry whatsoever. Everything is just like how we normally do everything. But the only thing is that I, di I didn't have this hair until a day before because I had to order it through um, someone that sells hair around here and the person had to deliver it because the sh no shops were open. So yeah, what happened is that this hair, that braiding hair that we bought, I don't know what was happening to it, was kind of reacting. Uh, her scalp was reacting to the braiding hair. And uh, because a day after we made this hair, she was complaining of the hair very itchy. I was like, oh, don't worry. Maybe it, after a day or two, it, everything will be fine. But the complaint kept coming and they're like, okay, you know what? Let's just wash your hair plus this braid together. So I used like very good amount of shampoo and, you know, I washed her hair very well. Washed the conditioner and all that. We conditioned her and we conditioned the hair and all that. You know and it was like okay everything was like good then the next day he was like oh it's still itchy they were like okay so maybe this hair is not good guys i don't know if anyone has experienced it i don't know if i'm not i'm not putting this story right but guys i've never experienced that kind of thing before so she was like i i want this hair off i want this hair off so we had to just like you know she got scissors and we just cut the braiding hair um off you know we even had to add bead on in this hair at the end of the video you see that but this hair was just on her hair for two days and we have to pull it out so i don't know i just want to ask other people that are watching and listening that have you ever had any experience with braiding hair being itchy or was she just acting up but i know she actually asked for this style so she wouldn't even want to remove it because she loves it it's like her favorite hairstyle so but she just took this hair off after two i think the third day or two days two days she took this hair off and yeah we have to like go and do something else to protect her hair so guys i don't know if you have experienced anything of such you can let me know and drop me a comment down in the comment section and because when I ask someone, they're like, oh, sometimes some hair needs to be treated. Well, how do you treat regular braiding hair? I know then in Nigeria, when I made like, you know, those million braids, they, they say they treat it, but what they do is like they dip it in hot water and make it like straight before they use it. Um, is that what they call, you call treatment? I don't know, but you know, I don't know how I can be putting braiding hair in hot water before. I can braid and this has never happened before so yeah so I, I, I would like you guys to discuss this with me in the comment section to let me know what you think what happened because this hair I really like the result I like how it came out though she doesn't have this style anymore she removed it long time but you know I just like okay I still have to share this video with people uh, because I know people love this kind of style I want to see how it's made so and it's detailed video so I showed a lot of um, up close and uh, different directions for you to see how it is made uh, don't be afraid to try it uh, don't be afraid to you know go uh, on and do it for your child um, it could be that 
this hair um the hair that we used wasn't good or i don't know what actually happened because we never experienced such before uh, other than that everything about this hairstyle is beautiful and it can last up to a month if you take care of it very well and we accessorize with beads and you see the picture at the end it's beautiful everything is perfect but you know we encountered <laughs> something so if you want to know what length i used um i used one and a half of braiding hair and i cut into three section and i made sure i pulled on the end to make it smooth at the end and i i use some beads to you know uh on the ends to have the look we're going for and if you watch the end you'll see the style because i inserted a picture on on, on there for you to see what it looks like yes yeah, so i just wanted to add that quickly